Passionate is really just an elegant way of saying obsessive. And I am completely obsessed. To me, there's something unbelievably alluring about hand-dyed color on yarn and fiber. I find it mesmerizing. Hand-dyed color has a heartbeat. It, it flickers. You just want to feel it in your hands and you want to watch the colors shift and transform between your fingers. I believe color is more than what you see. It's more than something nice to look at. I believe color can be healing, it can be comforting, it can bring joy, and it can express love. I'm Felicia Lowe, the founder of Sweet Georgia Yarns. We create hand-dyed knitting yarns and spinning fibers. Our focus is on luxurious, natural fibers dyed in stunningly saturated colors. We take fine wools like Merino, Polworth, and Blueface Lester and blend them with cashmere and silk to make yarns and fibers that we love and want to work with. We dye all our yarns and fibers by hand in small batches. Every color is mixed and applied to the yarn manually, following our own recipes that we have developed over the years. Depending on the colors we are dyeing, some skeins are created by layering thin glazes of color to the yarn, while our multicolored yarns are created by painting directly onto the skein. The yarns and fibers are heated to set the dyes and to make them color and wash fast. To preserve the yarn's softness and sheen, we rinse them at the studio and let them dry naturally. The skeins are then twisted, labeled, and packaged to be sent off into the world. Every skein of yarn dyed by hand has a special quality to it. There's this delicate and unique variation in shade and hue that we love and we seek out. It's what gives hand-dyed yarn the feeling of being alive. I struggled hard with the question, what do you want to be when you grow up? As a child, I was obsessed with knitting, sewing, music, and computers. So when I graduated high school, I knew I either wanted to be a fashion designer, an opera singer, or a computer programmer. For a long time, I thought that the biggest mistake in my life was that I didn't do any of these things. I ended up going to university to get a degree in pharmacy instead. And from day one, I knew that I was in the wrong place, but I decided to finish what I had started. Now I can't imagine anything else being a more perfect fit for me. There's design, art, chemistry, and technology in everything I do now. I started this company in 2005 at my dining room table. And at that time, every container of dye, every measuring spoon, and every stir stick fit into one plastic storage box. Since that time, I've moved through five different dye studios and grown to work with some amazing people in creating these yarns. Through color and yarn, I have personally experienced moments of transformation and pure awe. And it's something I want everyone to experience. So every day we're working to create colors and yarns that will bring light and comfort, joy and love into people's lives.